this is a channeled message for my collective. Your lack of pleasure in life is affecting you being able to feel your divinity. You're coming into a new phase of flow, of healing, with newfound material ease coming in. Don't forget that it can quickly turn into poison. Don't forget where you came from. You've gone through the things that you've gone through in the hopes that you won't forget when you have the ability to make a difference in the world. Choose love. You at this point have cleared many illusions from your life. And each time you come across a new filter or illusion in your mind, you have the ability to take action. You have the ability to find it, to solve it, to lift it. You're doing it every day. You've realized who you are. You're growing and you're living and healing. The birth of your prosperity is going to be fast growth. Don't forget your gratitude. Don't forget your divinity, your purpose, your love. You need to find a balance between the rest and the productivity. A divine end to your self-doubt is coming. You need to lean into that. When you feel powerful in your self-love, when you see it in you, hold on to it. Think about it often. Look for it when you can. And don't be afraid to fall in love with you. You can see your magic. You've always created it. And now it's time to be intentional about it. Give yourself the space to celebrate. You're going to unlock so many triumphs. You'll see all of your accomplished works. Your energy taking root and blossoming with endless supply of fruits. All things are possible through you. You need to understand when it is time to listen and when it is time to talk. When you need to teach a lesson, you do so by teaching what you have gone through. You should only speak to your experiences because when you directly try to solve someone else's problems, they get discouraged, defensive, sometimes angry. They need to come to their own realizations and thoughts or it will never hit like it needs to. You help with this best by sharing your direct experiences so that people can see through them, feel through them. It is more powerful than lecturing. It provides hope, community, love, and so much more. It inspires So go out and inspire, my love. Inspire and be inspired. Find a good balance between the two and lay in your divinity. You got this.